What's up everyone, I'm JP the Jeweler and in this video I'll be showing you all what rhodium plating is all about. Spoiler alert, white gold doesn't actually exist. It's composed of gold mixed with whiter alloys to give it a whiter hue. However, when it's mixed down, it actually has a beige hue. So what we do is apply rhodium on top of that white gold to give it that platinum white look. Over time, as the piece of jewelry gets worn, we're gonna see that the rhodium starts coming off, exposing the true white gold, which is more of that beige hue. The first step to rhodium plating is actually sanding down the piece, removing any of the heavy gouges or scratches on the piece of jewelry. Now that I've gotten rid of all the gouges and heavy scratching from the big wide areas of the ring, I want to go in with a very small sanding disc and get in the nooks and crannies to this ring, the areas where I can't reach with my big sanding box. Now that I've sanded down the piece and removed all the heavy scratching and gouges, I want to move over to my split lap and burnish the material, making it really flat to accept the high polish. Perfect, let's head to final polish. So this part is the final polishing of the product, giving it a mirror-like finish, ready for rhodium plating. In order for the rhodium to electroplate on the white gold perfectly, I'm going to try to get it as extremely clean as possible. So we'll first steam clean the ring, then we're going to electro clean the ring before rhodium plating. Now you know what rhodium plating is all about. I'm JP the Jeweler, and if you like how this ring turned out, be sure to subscribe to the channel. See you all next week.